I'm Erin Conrad. Here's a look at some of today's top stories from Two Works For You. New this afternoon, there are 743 new cases of COVID-19 here in Oklahoma. That brings the total number of cases since March to more than 119,000. 13 new deaths are being reported today. 1,286 Oklahomans have died from the virus in Oklahoma. Meanwhile, more than 102,000 people have recovered from COVID-19. And it is a sad day for the Tulsa Police Department as members mourn the loss of another officer. Tulsa Police confirming Officer Jared Lindsay has passed away from complications of COVID-19. Jared Lindsay started his career with the Tulsa Police Department back in 2005. He started as a patrol officer working the streets of Tulsa. He later went to work for his fellow officers as the chairman of the Tulsa Fraternal Order of Police and was the vice president for the Oklahoma Fraternal Order of Police. Right now, the FOP is not commenting as they go through their mourning process. Officer Lindsay was just 40 years old. He leaves behind a wife and two young sons. Now let's get a check of the forecast. All right, thank you very much, Aaron. This afternoon, remaining cold and soggy out there. Some of the rain tonight into the overnight hours could be heavy. We can may pick up an inch or two, especially north of town. 50 tomorrow, rain chances highest the first half of the day. And then finally, some sunshine returns for Friday. Your weekend forecast, Halloween, mid-60s, a little bit of a cool down heading into Sunday upper 50s and then a nice warm up heading into next week upper 60s Tuesday and Wednesday with 70s by Thursday and Friday. All right, definitely looking forward to some of that more fall like weather. Thank you, Clint. That's a look at some of the stories making headlines today. Stay with two works for you for the latest updates all throughout the day. I'm Erin Conrad two works for you.